Hello everyone, my name is Takovac Rafizadeh and in this video tutorial I want to show you how you can use my decals material inside of Unreal Engine 4. So without further ado, let's just get, let's get it started. As you can see, I have six different decals here. Uh, actually they are one package as a manhole cover and but you, but you have six different of them in this package each one of them is scanned and clean it uh, correctly by myself and because of too many comments i had uh, from uh, too many users in the uh, facebook pages of the uh, unreal engine 4 and the people asking me uh, please remove the border of the uh, materials and the manhole cover uh, for the better blending and compatibility with our uh, textures or our materials in the game or in the ground and I try to explain them sometimes you may want to use them with the uh, border of the ground of the uh, uh, decals and it should be better if you have uh, that uh, border of the ground in the decals too but I was thinking about it uh, that's a good idea to having uh, borders and to not having the borders so I created uh, new things uh, from them uh, inside of the uh, substance designer uh, with cooperating on, with all the package of the designer and too many other softwares to solving this kind of problem and creating something better or maybe I should say super useful for this case uh, what you can do right now with my decays is a little it's not complicated actually, but it's a little tricky. Uh, first of all, in each package, you have the same structure of the files, which is um, material, all the textures you have, and material instance uh, for the specific material, and another file is for the substance designer. In each one of them, you have the same structures and the same files and the unique uh, material instance mm. what you can do it's better if I uh, show that to you right now for example this is one of them this is a quad uh, or a square um, decays of the manhole cover which you can see here with the all details and as you can see we have a border around it uh, with, for the ground I was captured uh, with these details it's good for uh, using this kind of details on the same material or ground uh, if you have that kind of texture or maybe in some cases you don't have it or even when you have it you have that you have it with this different uh, color or different type of the material for this purpose and uh, I create this material instance uh, and what you can do inside of it is a little different with the other with the normal one you can you have in here first of all you have the output size which is the texture size and you can optimize it uh, depending on your uh, engine and what you uh, the platform you want to use it you can go from 32 to 4k resolution it depends on you and also I add border visibility amount we and the number one means you have all the borders and the zero means you deleting the borders and in this uh, situation you have only the decals without any ground borders or anything else but the number one means full border 
and between them means transparency the borders so this one is only for the border visibility I add three different uh, items for the blending the color between the borders in just in that case you want to use it with the ground material with your own ground material uh, as uh, let me show you and explain it with the material I have here as you can see it's a little obvious this uh, decay is not blind does not blind to the this uh, material and what you can do is actually it's open I can play with hue saturation and lightness in this case I think a little saturation can be a little better but I need to change the color too it's a little better and the light we need to make it a little darker yeah at this moment i just played a little with the numbers of the hue saturation i like this but i'm sure you can get a better result yeah if you're working on them more than than this and as you can see it's blended so much better than before with these settings so you have the same settings for all each one of them and you can use them however you want in your um, project and sorry for my bad english and this is the first time i try to record something for as a video tutorial for anyone else and i'm not professional at, on this kind of things uh, and I hope you learn it and it's not is uh, so hard it's so easy and I'm a bad teacher I know so please excuse me for that and I hope you guys like it and enjoy this package thank you so much and bye